What is up, family? Senior Cigar here. You are wherever you are. Hopefully you are healthy and safe and all that. Uh, if you hear music in the background, and you probably do, do not own the rights to the music. I'm not playing the music. got nothing to do with the music. The music is being provided by the establishment. Once again, do not own the rights to the music. Not playing the music. I have nothing to do with the music. Music is being provided by the establishment, and that particular establishment is Davidoff of Geneva in Williamsburg, Brooklyn. Brothers and sisters of the leaf, all you good people out there, uh, I got the day off today. So I've made my way into Williamsburg just to relax, you know, put some smoke in the air. Family, it is a Monday, brand new week, another chance to do great things, and I'm going to wish everybody a productive and profitable week. Um, as I said, I made my way into uh, Williamsburg, Davidoff of Geneva, putting some smoke in the air with this uh, La Polina, double digit, six by 60. Mm-hmm, yes indeed. Mm-hmm. And, uh, well, since I'm just sitting back relaxing, you know, senor's gotta do that San Pellegrino. Blood orange, sparkling water in the fancy glass, and you know why. Here's to you. Oh, yeah. So, late Monday afternoon, for many of you, you uh, may be getting ready to get off work. But wherever you are in your day, I hope that you're having a good day, and the rest of your day goes very, very well. So as I said, I got the day, day off. I got the next few days off. So I'm just going to be chilling. More than likely, I'm going to be here every day putting some smoke in the air. So if you want to come sit with me uh, in the afternoon at Davidoff of Geneva in Williamsburg, I'll be here around 5 o'clock every day this week, pretty much. If I'm not going to be here, I will let you know. But right now, as it stands, I'm going to be around here pretty much every day this week. Chilling, putting some smoke in the air, and just enjoying myself. And uh, hopefully, uh, when you get off work tonight, you are going to enjoy yourself with whatever you got planned. All right? So, family, mm. let us do what we do when we get together for the virtual hearth. Shout out to the medical professionals, the first responders, EMS workers, police and fire, postal workers, MTA workers, delivery people, truck drivers going across the country, the mom and pop shop owners, the bodega shop owners, the laundromat owners, anybody who has been considered or deemed essential personnel for the duration of the pandemic and moving forward. Thank you for what you have been doing for the duration of the pandemic and moving forward. Thank you for taking chances with your own health and safety for the health and safety of all of us in the city in this state, in and around this country, what you have been doing, it is so greatly appreciated. Saying thank you is not enough, but we do start out by saying thank you for everything you have been doing for the duration of the pandemic and moving forward. And of course, you know, I'm going to uh, remind you to please check in on the elders of your family. Your family and friends who live alone, they need to hear from you, they need to know that they are not alone, they need to know that someone loves them, so please reach out to them any way you can, whether it's through that phone call, or a text message, or, or a social media video chat, Zoom, house party, Google Door, FaceTime, Skype, and remind the people within your circle of friends to do that very same thing. Get in touch with their elders and their family and friends who live alone. Family, no one needs to be alone at this particular time in our lives. Absolutely no one. So please take the time, make the time, reach out to them. Find out how they're doing. See if they need anything. See if there's anything you can do for them. If this is someone you profess to love, then this should not be a problem. It is all about support. Right? It is about support. And while we do talk about support, uh, let us not forget 
all those fine ladies and gentlemen, all those great people that own the mom and pop shops, all those great small businesses, all those fantastic cigar shops and lounges in the tri-state area. They need our support now more than ever as well. Whether it's a shop where you can come in, make your purchase, grab and go, or maybe it's a lounge with comfortable seating where you can come in, make your purchase, find a spot to plop, sit back, relax, light up, put some smoke in the air like so. Oh yeah, maybe a pair that fine tobacco product with your drink of choice, whether it be an adult beverage or a soft drink, remember, your choice. And maybe even have a conversation with another brother and sister of the leaf, but family, none of that can be done unless you make the effort to go to that mom and pop shop. So, what does that mean? Let me tell you what that means. That means you're going to break open the piggy bank, fellas. You're going to open up your wallet, blow the dust out, pull out some dollar, dollar bills, y'all, and make your way to that mom and pop shop. And when you get there, well, you walk right in, you say, hello, to the fine tobacconist behind the counter because they're going to help you make your selection and your purchase. Then you're going to walk into that humidor. Oh, can you smell it? The aroma of all that fine tobacco from all those great cigar growing countries, Nicaragua, Dominican Republic, Venezuela, Honduras, Costa Rica, Puerto Rico. Come on now. Mm, it smells so good. You're going to walk around. You're going to see what's on the shelves. Make your selection and then proudly step up to that cash register and make it rain, baby. Make it rain. Spend a few dollars to keep their cash register ringing and their doors open because it is all about support. Hashtag support mom and pop shops. Hashtag support small business. Hashtag support black business. Hashtag support Latino business. Hashtag support Asian business. Hashtag support small business. Family, we are all in this together. And we need each other now more than ever. So please take the time, make the time. Get out there to that mom and pop shop that great cigar shop or lounge in the tri-state area and show your support. It is so very important, especially during these times. All right. All right now, so, uh, what's the uh, plan for tonight when you get off work? Because you're getting ready to get off work. I know you're getting ready to get off work, right? Five o'clock, six o'clock, seven o'clock, whenever the bell rings. What's the plan for tonight? Maybe a nice romantic dinner with your significant other. Maybe you're gonna go hang out at a bar with some friends, throw some back, pound some down, Monday night football. The, uh, later tonight, the National League Championship Series is gonna be happening. Right now, the American League Championship Series is going on. And, uh, and I'm watching it right now. And, uh, I'm sorry, it's the National League Championship Series going on right now and the American League Championship Series going on tonight, sorry. Um, but, you know, maybe you want to do that. Maybe you decided, you know, I am going to go to that uh, mom and pop shop, that great small business, that great cigar lounge in the tri-state area to put some smoke in the air, have a conversation or two with a, with a, with a brother and sister of the Leaf and watch Monday Night Football or the American League Championship Series. Maybe you decided, I want to go see, uh, I got tickets to see a movie or a Broadway show or a concert or a comedy show. Or maybe you said, I'm feeling kind of frisky. I think I want to go do a little karaoke, family, whatever you got planned for tonight or any night moving forward. Make sure that a part of that plan is staying safe. Stay safe so you stay healthy, so you can stay alive. The coronavirus, the pandemic is quote unquote over, but the coronavirus is still out there. And you got to do everything within your power to make sure you do not contract COVID-19. And a part of staying safe and healthy, well, staying hydrated. 
Whenever you go out, have that bottle of water, that lemonade or that iced tea or whatever you need to stay refreshed and hydrated. Come on, fam. Take it from Senor Cigar. You will thank me later for that bit of advice. All right? So whenever you go out, make sure you got that plan. Stay safe so you can stay healthy so you can stay alive. All right, brothers and sisters of the leaf, all you fine people out there that enjoy fine tobacco products, I am going to wrap this up so I can continue to enjoy this fine tobacco product here, this uh, La Polina double digit, 6 by 60 and enjoy the National League Championship Series, which is uh, up on the screen here. Family, please don't forget, check in on the elders of your family, your family and friends who live alone. They need to hear from you. They need to know that they're not alone. They need to know that someone loves them. They need to know that together we are getting through this. Yes, we are getting through this. Hashtag support mom and pop shops. Hashtag support small business. And whenever you go out, make sure you've got that plan. Stay safe so you can stay healthy, so you can stay alive. All right, fam, that is it. That is all I got. I am that man. Senor Cigar, enjoying my fine tobacco product. Popping my collar, cause I can. And as always, I want to wish you long ashes. Better days. Everybody, enjoy the rest of your Monday. At some point, I do hope you'll be able to put some smoke in the air. Y'all know, love you like a fat kid loves cake and there's nothing you can do about it. Hope to talk to you again real soon, but in the meantime, holla. If you hear me. Yeah, baby.